And then it went for a, from a game where it looked like you're going to score a bunch to, to maybe you're going to have to scrap for one or two late to win the game. But the offense stuck with the plan, just kept just kept trying to get their pitch and get their swing off. And you know, because the weather here is a lot different, so it was good to see, like you guys said, the bats were alive today, and that was really good to see because you know we've been playing in warm weather this first month, so coming up here in the cold and doing well it was really good. Breaking ball this time, and it's hit down into the gap in right field. Rounding first is Jutkins as one run will score and two runs will score. Jutkins is going to go back over to first. He's got his second hit. I had a couple base hits on some breaking balls. Uh, just stayed back on it and tried to put my best swing on it. Yeah, we had a couple big innings that uh, really helped the pitching staff out, and including myself. And uh, um, it was just nice uh, being able to contribute. Yeah, I mean, it looked like it was going to be one of those days where, you know, you might have to score 20 to win uh, the way it started out. You know, they put a couple up early on us, and then we answered back with five, and you, you kind of felt good about things. Oh. Pitching-wise, you know, it was, it, was, it was okay. There was some... There's some positive. Shane Ritter was a lot better today. Josh Marching was a lot better today. We got Elijah Wood in the game, and Elijah did a nice job for the first time uh, pitching for the Hawkeyes. And uh, Grant, in his start, you know, Grant wasn't real sharp. He was up in the zone, but um, you know, we got through it, and it was a big swing game for us. You know, uh, our seven to four sounds a whole lot better than uh, six and five. So um, happy to get a win here at home. That's a Hawkeye winner. Final score: Hawkeyes 12. Huskies 8.